musical highlight for you. He's an entrepreneur whose main focus has always been building innovative teams. And he likes to compare making music with building up those agile, great working teams. I trust that this will be really interesting. So a big welcome to Richard De Hoop. The stage is yours. I want to explain why music, because as a little boy, and I'm certain you had this question from your parents, right? In my case, my mother came up to me, and she asked me, Richard, what do you want to become when you grow up? And I said, Mom, I'd like to be a rock star. And she said, you do that, because most of them cannot sing either. <laughs> but, <laughs> but that motivated me to, to practice and to, to practice my skills and... At that age, I noticed that with some guys, it was so easy to make music with. And with others, it was so hard. <laughs> but just imagine that you could see the character of the person sitting next to you being a musical instrument. That means that you can play together. Hey, I would like to introduce our orchestra to you. Not by saying this is the bass or this is the drum, but with each of the instruments, I would like to... Compare them a little bit with a character of a person. And the first instrument I really like to introduce. So think of yourself as being a, a human being, the character. Ladies and gentlemen, are the basses. And basses are big instruments with usually four strings. And with the four strings, they all play the low notes in our pieces. Those are the very, very down-to-earth people. They're the ones that roll up their sleeves, spit in their hands, let's say, come on, let's just do it. Totally different from the basses are the drums. <laughs> and when you hear a drum, what is the first thing that pops up into your mind? What is the first thing that you think of when you hear a drum? You, Why? Can't, you can't blame them. I, I mean, the drum, they love to set the tempo. They love to set goals. And they like to challenge everyone. They like to put pressure on people. They like to take risks. You know, the violins. And when you hear the violin, you start thinking, thinking about your neighbor sitting next to you. And you're asking yourself, oh, wouldn't it be great if I was to shunkle along with my colleagues here in Berlin? Let's give a big hand for your colleague! <laughs> and this is exactly what teamwork's all about coping with all these differences. Not only coping with different ideas, but coping with different characters. And the success lies in you being the conductor of your own orchestra, coping with all these different instruments. Only if we are willing and able to share the three secrets in music with each other, then you can outstand everyone. And the three secrets in music are, are you willing to listen to each other? Are you willing to tune into each other? And are you willing to play together? So, with all the instruments here, I like to, let's just play, just pick up your instrument. Slow for the basses, oh, baritones, oh, sopranos, oh. Okay, I count to four. Here we go, one, two, three, Four. Ooh. 